History is a series of short stories, pieces of a puzzle that, assembled, help us understand it all. How the Great Ones rose, where they came from, and how they endure. What they fought for, what they did to survive, how they changed perception, why they believed where no one else did, and how they forged a lasting legacy. If you thought you knew UFC history, this is the whole story in 25 parts. UFC 25 years in short. Saturday, before the two title fights between Max Holloway and Brian Ortega, Valentina Shevchenko and Joanna Janczajczak, Watch the UFC 231 prelims on FS1. She is dangerous. Brutal power in this kid, and extremely dangerous. UFC 231 prelims, Saturday at 6.30 Eastern on FS1 and the Fox Sports app. We are closing out the year in style. There's so many good fights. Max West Holloway, the winning streak is a dozen. Taking on the undefeated up and coming. T City going to work. The greatest alive. I'm the greatest alive. I'm the greatest to fear me. Ain't nobody seeing me. Young J Jack versus Shevchenko. Two of the most decorated strikers in MMA, period. Two championship fights. What a night! UFC fans, we'd like to welcome you to the weigh-in for UFC 231, Holloway versus Ortega. Tomorrow night, Toronto plays host to one of the most anticipated featherweight championship matchups in recent memory. As Max Blessed Holloway puts his title and his 12-fight winning streak on the line against the undefeated Gracie Jiu-Jitsu phenom, Brian T-City Ortega. Plus, in the co-main event, a new women's flyweight champion will be crowned as Valentina Shevchenko faces the former strawweight queen, Joanna Yonjecha. We would like to thank our UFC sponsor, EA Sports UFC 3, available now for up to 70% off. Buy it today on Xbox One and receive a copy of Fight Night Champion to play through Xbox One backwards compatibility, available for a limited time. We would also like to send a special welcome to our UFC Fight Club members in attendance today. We hope to see all of you once again for the live action tomorrow night. And now for the call of the way in for UFC 231. Here is Joe Rogan. What's happening, Toronto? Welcome to the way in. How about a nice round of applause for Ariani, Chrissy, Vanessa, Dana White. Without him, none of this would be possible. Bruce Buffer, the voice of the octagon. Sean Shelby and Mick Maynard, Maynard, matchmakers extraordinaire, and we got a hell of a card for you folks. We're gonna kick things off on Fight Pass in the light heavyweight division. Devin Clark versus Alexander Rockage. Up on the scale, Alexander Rockich. Official weight, 206. And his opponent, Devin Clark. Official weight, 205 for Mr. Clark. First fight of the night, ladies and gentlemen. 
Official weight, 184 
women's flyweight division. Caitlin Chukugian versus Jessica I.
opponent, Jimmy Manoa. Official weight, two. Tina Shevchenko versus Joanna Yunjecek for the UFC Women's Flyweight Championship. You're talking about two of the best strikers in women's mixed martial arts, period. I faced Valentina Shevchenko for three times back in the day when I was a Muay Thai fighter. Uh, I thought that I was going to win the world championship, so after I lost, she was my kind of like motivation to, you know, keep on training and proving that I can I can beat her one day, one day, one day, one day, one day. Oh man! Oh God! Just constant punishment by Jacek. Total domination. Won the belt in her third UFC fight by stopping Carla Esparza. Went on to the five consecutive times. We are looking at maybe the greatest female fighter this sport has ever seen. You know, it's been 10 years, and, and we are going to meet in the octagon, you know, not on the ring. So it's going to be totally different. I expect to give and live 
everything in the octagon. So it will be great stand-up work. Valentina Shevchenko, she's a multiple-time world Muay Thai champion, and she is absolutely dangerous. She's very physically strong for 125 pounds. She's got a full arsenal of striking technique and has an outstanding ground game as well. And there's the tap, flyweight division. Say hello to your worst nightmare. I will do everything to win the fight. This is my year. My goal is title. Uh, I have a chance to become the first UFC female fighter with two belts in different weight classes. I will be making history soon, baby. Yes, she was a queen when she held the belt of strawway, but this time she's coming in wrong territory because this territory is mine. No one and nothing can stop me. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing the former Broadway champion of the world, Yolanda Yamtake! Official weight, 123.5 for Miss Shevchenko. All right, I'm here with the former straw weight queen, Yoni and Jacek. I know you're very happy about this weight class. You struggled for years to make the 115 pound class. Tell us how you feel about this and how you feel about this opportunity to fight Valentina tomorrow night. Uh, I feel like hog. So I feel very strong and weight cut sucks, but not this time. I feel great, I feel powerful. I made history signing the agreement for this fight and I will put the second sign tomorrow night. Thank you for coming. Love you guys. Thank you. Good luck to you, young. With Valentina, ladies and gentlemen, again, this is a, an absolutely outstanding weight class for you and an excellent matchup as well that many people have been looking forward to seeing. Tell us how you feel about facing Ioana tomorrow night and what it means to be fighting for the title. You know, I feel so strong. I feel so powerful, so speed. Tomorrow, nothing can stop me. Tomorrow, my night. And I will go to the end because I won't live without the belt. Tomorrow, my night. Good luck to you, ma'am. Valentina Shevchenko, ladies and gentlemen. And now, let's take a look at the two men involved in the main event of the evening. This is the most talked about fight in the featherweight division since Connor and Jose Aldo. I always said it, it, it's just a matter of time before we meet. Him and I are so good that we went through the division. Oh, that is it! Brian T. City Ortega is still undefeated! And there's nowhere to go no more. Every single time I fight someone, it's like, this is the guy that's gonna stop Max. Guess what? 
That guy didn't stop it. Holloway's pouring it on. He's melting. That's it. That guy didn't stop me. Oh, no. that's it. Do it. That's, that's it. Holloway. The winning streak is a dozen. And this guy sure hell ain't stopping me. I'm setting the bar. I dare you to beat me. I dare you. This is the type of matchup you want to see when you have a young, phenomenal champion like Max Holloway. You want to see an undefeated phenom meet him for the championship of the world. Both men have real potential to be all-time greats. I'm not a decision fighter. I'm not a point-based fighter. Submission attempt once again. Oh, and there's the tap! When I go in there, my objective is simple. Finish the man in front of me at all costs. Oh, big knee, huge knee by Ortega. Hit it, it's all it. over. I'm the guy who, who's undefeated, finished legends. Oh, knocked out for Ortega. Key City. And now I'm here, knocking at the door, trying to get the title. I'm going to keep doing what I do best. Oh! Win fights, we're going to grab my belt, and on to the next. I want to prove to everybody that I'm the best. I want to be the GOAT. I'm not even close to my peak, and I know it, you know? I'm not even close to being full potential. No one's going to stop this. I've, I've sacrificed a lot. I've trained a lot. I've done everything that I possibly can to get here. And I'm not leaving without that belt. Ortega, if you think your uh, finishing streak is going to continue, I got bad news for you. All good things come to an end. Welcome to the Blessed Era, baby. Ladies and gentlemen, for the featherweight championship of the world, introducing the challenger, Ryan Ortega! Like they said, it's very rare in the UFC where you get two young, hungry motherfuckers who are ready to throw down. And we're gonna give you guys a show that you guys been waiting for for a long time, baby. It's time now. Good luck to you, sir. Brian Ortega, ladies and gentlemen. I'm here with the champ. Max, all the talk is done. All the setbacks are gone. You are here tonight to defend your title tomorrow night. Tell us how you feel about all this. Hey, the Blessed Express is on the move, baby. Next up, T-City. What island is this? Tenth Island, baby. Let's go. Good luck to you, sir. Thank you all for coming out. We'll see you tomorrow night. versus Brian Ortega for the UFC Featherweight Championship of the World is one of the highest level matchups in the history of the Featherweight division. Brian T. City Ortega is still undefeated. I'm gonna keep the finishing streak going. I'm coming for Max Holloway and we're gonna get that belt. 
I'm gonna keep doing what I do best. Win fights. The winning streak is a dozen. And on to the next. Him and I are so good that we went through the division. And there's nowhere to go no more. Now it's my time. Oh, and there's the tap! My destiny. Oh! The belt's next. It's time to just prove to the world I'm the best to ever do it. Welcome to the blessed era, baby. Oh! Max Holloway! I'm not leaving without that belt. Come get me. I dare you.